morning, boys and girls. It's Super Pastor. Super Pastor is back to teach you a little bit about God. But before we do that, I need your help. You think you can help me this morning? I put my arm in the, the sky like this. I need you to shout out Super Pastor. Okay, here we go. It's all about Super Pastor today. Super Pastor reads the Bible faster than a speeding bullet. He's Super Pastor. Super Pastor is known to read his devotions every day. He's known to read the Bible as fast as anything can be. He even visits the sick and the shut-ins on his day off. He is Super Pastor. Super Pastor is the world's favorite pastor. All the children love him the most because he is Super Pastor. You got it. Super Pastor is here. And Super Pastor has heard that you've been learning about the Ten Commandments. Is that right? Pastor Casey told me that the last few weeks you've been learning about the Ten Commandments. And that got Super Pastor to think a little bit. That maybe, just maybe, Super Pastor wants to come up with some commandments of his own. Okay? So I want you to hear me out. I've got three of them. Okay? Thumbs up if you like this commandment. Thumbs down if you say no. Okay? Super Pastor commandment number one. Tomorrow is President's Day. But I thought rather than having President's Day, we have Super Pastor Day. What do you think? Thumbs up? Thumbs up? Oh, Isaac's saying no. But I see a few thumbs up. All right. Some of you are still on board with me. All right. Commandment number two. And then we're getting a little bit more complicated. All those superhero shows that you like to watch. Batman and The Flash and The Hulk and all the other superheroes that are out there. Super Pastor's commandment is, you shall not watch any of those superhero shows because Super Pastor is the only superhero in the world. What do you say to that? No, no, no. All right, here's the last one. I think Super Pastor likes this best of all. This last Thursday, Super Pastor's heard that you've received a lot of candy because it was Valentine's Day. Super Pastor commandment number three is next Sunday you bring all that candy and you give it to Super Pastor! No! No! Oh, come on, no! Well, alright. That was kind of silly, wasn't it? That's it's Super Pastor. It's Super Pastor. You can wear this, alright, Sam? You want to put that on your face? <laughs> All right, now I need you to put on your listening ears. Because the super pastor is kind of silly sometimes, isn't he? Those commandments. He's like Superman. He is like Superman. He's super pastor. You look like Superman, Sammy. The point of this is that God gave us commandments. And they're not commandments to be silly. And they're not commandments to help out only God himself. But Isaac, the reason that God gave us the Ten Commandments <coughs> is because God loves us. And all the Ten Commandments are for our own good. They help us be stronger. They help us be healthier. They help us be better people. Like, I'm going to teach you a new commandment. Something we haven't learned today. Thou shalt not lie. Do you think that's a good commandment? I think it's a great commandment. I think it's a really good commandment. Because that way people have to tell the truth. Another one is, Rosalind, thou shalt not steal. Do you think that's a good commandment? No. I think that's a great commandment. Because we don't want people taking our stuff, do we? Another one is, thou shalt not <coughs> hurt other people. In fact, the commandment says, thou shalt not kill. But this includes all types of do you think that's a good commandment? I think that's a great commandment. So we don't want other kids coming up and hurting us either. So the Ten Commandments, not Super Pastor's Commandments, but the Ten Commandments that God gives us, they're for our own good. And God gave us not those commandments just to have silly rules, but they help us, Sammy, and they make us better people, and they keep us safe, all right? I appreciate your help this morning. Rosalind, do you want to say our prayer for us this morning? you want to pray for us? Want to pray? Come on, Rosalyn. Let me get my microphone real quick. Everybody else fold their hands. <coughs> bow their, their, their heads. And Rosalyn's going to say her prayer this morning. All right, Rosalyn. Rosalyn. 
and say, Dear God, Dear God, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. For the Ten Commandments.